Hi guys, welcome you again to another news. A lot of people have been reacting differently to issues concerning the Islamic police, that is the Ujba. A lot of people said these people are working contrary to the Quran, of which they said they are working in line with. They are working dangerously against Islam. Now, this same Islamic police are stopped some barbing, you know, salons from giving different hairstyles, different haircuts to their customers, all in the name of Islam. The same Islamic police is pounding 5,800 bottles of beer in Kano State. A lot of beer stations have been shut down in different northern states as a result of these, you know, police. Well, we would like you to sit tight as you go into the full details of the news. If you are coming across this channel for the very first time, don't just watch and leave to subscribe and don't forget to turn on the bell icon to get you notified and time we post a new update. And also a big shout out to our existing subscribers, I want to say a big thank you to you for liking, sharing and commenting. I want to employ you to continue to do so and as you do, you may bless. Now to the full gist of the news. Operatives of Sharia Police, Ishba. Kano State Commission and the Sharia Board have impounded three vehicles laden with 5,800 bottles of beer. This was contained in a statement made on Monday by the Commander General of the Ishba Board, Harun Haibi N. Sina, in Kano while inspecting the impounded vehicles at the Ishba office. According to the board's spokesman, Lawan Fagi, three vehicles were impounded on Sunday, noting that a Mercedes-Benz car had 1,800 bottles of beer in it, a Sienna minibus conveying 3,000 bottles of beers, and a Volkswagen, a golf car conveying 1,000 bottles of beers. IBN Sina commended the anti-intoxicant units that impounded the vehicles for its efforts at ensuring the stoppage of consumption of alcoholic privileges and harmful drugs in the state. The Commander General gave assurance that the board would not relent in its efforts at sanitizing Kano's state of all forms of vices, especially drug peddling and abuse he directed the legal department of the board to follow due process by handing over the consignment of the cause for necessary action Kano state isba board is working assiduously to ensure full compliance and strict adherence to laws and regulations islamic teaching good morals and peaceful coexistence between different ethnic and religious groups. The board will collaborate with relevant stakeholders to achieve the desired objective, he stressed. Jamilu Hassan Yakasai, head of the anti-intoxicant unit, had earlier noted that the three vehicles were impounded while in their attempt to convey beer to Kano. Jamilo explained that the unit was working in the 44 local government areas of the state to ensure full compliance and strict adherence to law ban in banning sales and consumption of intoxicants in Kano State. The unit will not relent until bear consumption become history in Kano State, he said. What is your take to this? What is your own reaction to this brand development? We just had the full gist about the Islamic police, as we all know, Ishba, who have impounded over 5,800 bottles of bears that, you know, that was moving to Kano State. What is your take on this? What is your own reaction to this brand development? A lot of people are reacting differently, just like what has been said by Saint Anthony. He said, Is there anything that can cure this madness? Why does Kano share in the vats from alcohol? 
to Ishba should go and fight bandits, Boko Haram and ISWAP terrorists, please. What is your take to this? We've just heard what Anthony have said. That is there anything that can actually cure this madness of this Ishba police? Why does Kano still share from the value added tax from alcohol, despite the fact that these people are banning alcohol, doing all sorts of things, pounding over 5,800 bottles of alcohol moving to Kano State, and yet they still share from the value added tax from alcohol? Why are they doing this? Why are they still having their own share of it? This Ishba should go and fight bandits. Boko Haram and Aishwab terrorist. That is what has been said by Anthony. What is your take to this? Paul Chukumazo reacted and said, Why are they destroying people's properties? How can a sane country practice two constitutions in one country? Nigeria is a lawless state. A lot of people have been saying this and times that number. We've seen evidence to prove that Nigeria is a lawless state. Now, Paul Chukuma is also saying that. Why are they destroying people's properties? Why are they destroying people's properties? How can a same country practice two constitution in one country? Shola Dari also said, another useless generation deceiving themselves. If Sharia law should be allowed, you know, should be allowed northerners, will suffer the more. That is what has been said. That is, if the Sharia law is allowed, Northerners will be the one to suffer the more. That is what Shola Dari have said. What is your take to this? A lot of people are reacting differently. We would like you to let us know your own take on this. But these people can spend beer tax. No be madness. Two countries under one. Now them go still divide this country at last. Exactly what has been said earlier. This reaction is from Aji Boy. Who have said that these people will later divide nigeria at last because how can a country practice two constitution it isn't possible but these people they can spend beer taxes just like what has been said earlier by anthony saying that why are these people still having their own share of the valued added tax from alcohol despite the fact that they are impounding bottles of beers in their states we would like you to let us know your own take on this. We would like you to share on point of view with us via the comment section. A lot of people have react. We would like you to let us know your own you know, point of view to this. Do you think the Ishba police are right by impounding these bottles of beers? Or do you think they shouldn't have done that? We would like you to share your own view with us on this. Thank you guys for listening. Do subscribe to this channel if you have not. And I will see you on the other news. Bye for now.